is time for the single, hopefully redeeming game of Nintendo Switch Sports. Thanks for watching, by the way. Let's do some work today. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do the turkey dance today, but if I get a turkey, I think I still remember the tune for the turkey dance. How many of you guys remember it? I know some of you guys were singing it uh, the other day when we were playing through the very exciting game Wii Sports on Nintendo Wii. We played through all of the bowling modes. There was um, power bowling. It was a really cool mode where not only did you have 10 pins, but you had 20 pins, 30 pins, 40 pins, 50 pins, 60 pins, 70 pins, 80 pins, 90 pins. And then you could throw the ball on the edge and like get it all the way down, hit the red switch, they all fall down. It was so cool. Then there were some obstacles and there was picking up spares. There's a lot of cool training in, in Wii Sports. Here's hoping that the brand new Nintendo Switch Sports, 16 years later, can replicate, if not harness the exact same amount of charm, personality, gameplay, as a tech demo did 16 years ago. That's my hope and hope and just overall aspiration for it. Anyway, uh, thanks so much for coming, everyone. Hi, how are you? What's happening? It's Abdallah here, uh, back with more Nintendo Switch Sports. Uh, I've been having a fun time. Oh, wrong Joy-Con. Let me use the other one. I've been having a fun time playing this game. Uh, I bought the game, uh, what, last night on the eShop? And now we're going through. This is our third video of the series. Welcome to it. We've already given you guys a, a look at volleyball, which was fun. Uh, we gave you a look at tennis, which was all right. Uh, but now, really, Wii Sports Bowling uh, or Nintendo Switch Sports Bowling is exactly what we're going to be doing on this episode. There is an extra bonus mode, like a challenge mode, which is cool. There wasn't any challenge modes or training modes or any other modes for that much uh, when it came to uh, playing the previous two games. So, anyway, it is what it is. Thanks so much for watching. Hi! You guys ready for bowling? I know you are. Let's see some bowling pin emotes, some bowling ball emotes. All of you guys, I got to see some hype in the chat. Trust me, I'm gonna need it. I'm gonna need it because bowling was actually one of my favorites. I really hope that it's like using this trigger and just like, and I hope there's like subtle like McTwists in order to put some spin on it. I really hope that there's gonna be a lot of fun stuff. But anyway, I'm excited for it. I'm excited for it and I hope you guys are too. Welcome back everyone. It's Abdallah here with more Nintendo Switch Sports. Let's jump into bowling, the most famous game on Nintendo Wii, right? You guys remember on Nintendo Wii, remember one of these guys where your grandma or your parents uh, played bowling the entire time and they probably beat you a lot. Uh, but anyway, we're gonna see exactly how it translates into the 2022 version of the game. So let's jump in playing locally. We'll do a quick 10 frame and uh, I'll let you know exactly how it feels considering the fact that we just got done playing through Wii Sports not too long ago. All right, so here we go, bowling one through four. As you can see, you can play with four players. Great, cool, party game. Uh, you can do standard, or you can do special. Whoa, an extra mode, wow. They really went all out on extra programming outside of just the standard stuff. I think they did a phenomenal job with that. So let's jump in over here. Oh, look at this cool dude. Yeah, I was standing like that a little earlier. All right, let's go. We're gonna do regular 10, uh, 10 pin bowling, and uh, I'm very excited for this. Like, low-key. Low-key. Very, very excited. Oh, look at this. Spaco Square. The lore, the area. I really want to just walk around and explore it. I really do. Okay, here we go. Uh, yeah, 10 frames. Ooh, look at me starting over here first. You know what? Oh, oh, look, 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 look. Up. Down. Up. Okay, that's decent. Hold a Joy-Con control in front of your arm while holding ZR. Swing while holding down ZR uh, without letting go. Okay, got it. So it's teaching you how to play it. Notice how they didn't teach us how to play tennis. Okay. Oh, okay. What am I- am I doing something wrong? What are you doing here? Hold the Joy-Con in front of your chest and perform a rolling motion.
Guys, uh, I, I, I can't seem to get past the tutorial. What was that? Dude, the polish on this game, man. <laughs> Let's talk about it. Okay. Um, there was absolutely zero spin on that, but let me see if I can kind of... Dude, what? Don't do this, man. Don't do this to me. Not today. Okay, okay, so I did, I did do the mick twist. Hold on, let me see if I can show you with my arm. Uh, I went like this, and then I got it. So, I guess that's cool. Great. Here we go. What is that? You saw me do it. <laughs> oh my gosh, help me. Oh man, if the controls on a Wiimote from 16 years ago are better than this, that's saying something, man. And trust me, I'm doing the exact same thing. What am I missing here? And let go. Why is that wrong? I love this game. I love Wii Sports. Nintendo Switch Sports. What was with that? Do I have to wait until I get up to the line and then let go? Is that a timing gateway that I have to cross? Alright, whatever. Oh, oh, okay. Rotate and move. Why do you... Okay. Guys. Guys, kind of worried. What? I love this game. I love this game. I love this game. It's a good game. It's a good game. It's a good game. It's a good game. This is a good game. I want this game to be good. Ready? Now let go. How is that wrong? I'm two seconds from walking out the door right now. Come on, bowling! What? Okay. I'm not doing anything wrong. What? Do I have to pretend I'm walking up? There's no go quick. After the 20th try? <laughs> I love this. Oh my gosh, man. Wait, so I'm not letting go of it? You're telling me I'm not letting go? Oh! I'm sorry. They changed the controls on me. So you don't let go of the ball instinctively like we've learned in the previous two games. Why did they do that? <laughs> Alright, now we play. Stop letting go of the ball and just go like this. Okay, that's silly. Boo! Alright. Obviously, I was letting go of it. So you don't let things go in this. You just, you just, just swing like this. And you don't let go. Okay, now I can play bowling now. How hilarious. Let's all laugh at the game. Uh, very instinctively. Alright, well these straight balls are pretty good actually. I mean, cool. Um, it's a very straight ball. Can I zoom in? Okay, uh, yeah, yeah, I could, I could do this. If I can, if I can bowl a straight ball, I think that that's really good, right? Because then I could just adjust my character to uh, move wherever I need to move. And I just need to make sure that I'm going in the same right spot. Easy, easy bowling. Okay, I, I twisted that way, and it kind of twisted the other way. Talk to me about this really quick. All right, straight ball is good, man. I'm I'm fine doing straight ball. I want to see, because, you know, pros do like a little, uh, they do a hook at the end. Uh, and then they hit either, you know, 
pins one and two and hook to the right, or they hit pins one and three and they hook to the left. So I'm genuinely curious as to how that works here. I'm gonna give it a shot. It, oh, okay, okay, hold on. This is a. Uh... So I'm gonna try a uh, like a genuine twist. Like that. Okay, that was actually cool. That was actually cool. Now that I'm getting the hang of the game, like we're all set. Let's go. This is funny. All right, let me try that again. That was really nice, actually. So I did this roll, and then I twisted my arm. Whoa! Hey, hey, hey! Easy, easy, easy there, twisty over here. Get the mick twist? I don't think so. Let me try that again. I don't know if I like that. Ugh. Holy moly, that's a lot of McTwist. I don't think I could... No, 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 no. We're not going to do that. I could do straight ball all day. Let me do straight ball all day and see what happens. Yeah, like, that's a little bit better. And then, like, I can just pick and choose. Like, okay, well, here's the thing. And I can literally straight ball it without any worry. So like that exact same motion in Wii Sports would put me a little left curve. Uh, but hey, we're good, we're good, let's go. Uh, I need a little bit more. I need a little bit. Oh, and that's the game, that was the last, okay. So that was a good practice. 131 personal bent, best on a practice run. Um, I was fumbling with the ball a little bit because I thought that like, if you're holding onto a bowling ball, in real life, you're gonna not hold onto it and let it drag you all the way across. That's not how you do it. <laughs> and Wii Sports and Wii Sports Resort, you had to let go as you like throw it, right? Let go, because you're not bringing your arm with. So, counterintuitive? <laughs> oh man, this game's good. This game's real good, man. All right, let's play another one. Let's play another one. Um, yeah, yeah. You guys, you guys leave your arms in the bowling ball and you let the bowling ball like drag you all the way down. Is that how you guys do it? I gotta find the setup to be honest. I have to find the setup of where my straight ball will get a strike every time, uh, like that. Decent. It's not good enough, nine pin. As long as I can pick up spares, I'm good, man. Okay, so this is this is gonna be fine. Bowling seems legit. Um, honestly, I don't care too much about the new controls on bowling. But I just need to find out exactly where my straight ball gets a strike. And not just the corner hits. So let's give this another go. Uh, it seems pretty consistent, to be honest. Um, it feels it feels very good compared to like Wii Sports, so I'm I'm loving that 100%. So I'm gonna do over here with a little bit of overlap, straight ball. That's what I want. Okay, okay, I got the little bit of overlap. I can do a perfect game. If I can consistently hit the straight ball, zoom in over here. Uh, what did I do? A little bit of overlap there. Yeah, yeah. Okay, not bad. Not bad at all. Let me see if I can just tilt this way. Gonna go over here. Every single frame I've gotten a mark, so... I don't know. I don't know. Bowling. Trying to find out where the overlap is. Okay, so if I can do this... Yeah, this is splitting that little triangle directly in half. I'm gonna try that. If that works, then I know exactly where to go for a, uh, a strike every time. Okay, that's good. We, I can perfect, I can perfect game this. Watch. So taking this, yeah, there we go. Right in half. Okay, guys, I think I figured it out. That's a double. I'm not celebrating a double, but that's pretty cool. All right, watch, watch, watch. Let me see if I figure this out. Okay, so just do like the halfway. Like you split this triangle like directly in half. It's time for the turkey dance. It's time for the turkey dance. 
one. A very subtle movement like this. Yeah, yeah, just like that. Okay. Dude, come on, man. I was off by a hair or something. I don't, I don't, I couldn't tell you. I honestly couldn't tell you why I was off that. I'm probably going to bowl like a 160 or something like this after here. I got a couple strikes, but I don't know. We're picking up every spare, which is good. But like, this is what I did twice in a row. I split this thing in half. Yeah, like that. And then we threw exactly the same way every time. Boom. But I'm missing that, uh, what is that, 10 pin? I'm missing that corner one. Yeah, 10 pin's getting pretty tricky over here. <gasps> okay, picking up spares. It's my, it's my day job at this point. How did I do that? There we go, that's really good. Okay, okay, you know what? I can, I can do some work. We could do some work here. Triple frame turkey? Or last frame turkey? Let's go. Yeah. Huh. Oh, come on. Ten pin. Ten pin's being a, a guy. Why is he doing that? Every single one, we got a mark on every frame. Like, I didn't miss it all. So, yeah. yeah bowling, bowling. Not too bad. Not too bad. Kind of fun. Uh, let me get a little bit of extra credit over here. This one's a last strike. Watch. Last strike! Ooh, yeah! Okay, that actually worked out very well. Called the last strike. Got it. Love it. Okay, so that was like a 170, 180. Finish. Personal best. If I get 200, I'm golden. Okay, that's great. I'll take a 200. If you can bowl over 200, you're good. Honestly, what I say in real life is if you can bowl over 100, you're phenomenal. <laughs> because bowling in real life is very hard. And let alone, if you've ever done a 200 game in your lifetime, consider that like a bucket list achievement. You're great. Um, so yeah, best score, 206. I think I've figured out like a little spot where I can kind of like, maybe 60% of the time get a spike or uh, a strike. So yeah, kind of cool. Do I like that? Yeah. Did I think that this kind of translates very well? I think it's honestly the exact same copy-pasted programming as it was in Wii Sports. So if you played Wii Sports, outside of the concept of letting go, like letting go of the controller to throw the ball, you just swing and you're done. So maybe they took the feedback that, um, I don't know, that other people had a hard time with that? No clue. Proper bowling form. Okay, mimic actual motions of bowling as much as possible. Fundamentals are important. Why does that matter? <laughs> does it matter, man? You want me to, like, walk forward and then bowl? Like, is that what we're doing here? <laughs> I'll, I'll do it. So I'll make sure. Or do I walk towards the camera? Boom! Hit my counter? No way. I will never do that. Okay, so anyway... That's regular bowling. I think uh, I think we're gonna jump into the main little challenge mode, the gimmick mode, uh, which is like a like a whole bunch of barriers or something I've seen in trailers. So I'm really excited for that. So anyway, bowling is actually good. Okay, so it is. I don't think there's anything else I would change about it. The fundamental gameplay is the exact same thing, and for that, it's a win in my book. Congratulations. Good job. You successfully copy pasted coding. From 2006. You're awesome. Excellent. Excellent. It's the least you could do <laughs> with updated graphics. All right, anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, next time, we're going to jump into our challenge mode of bowling. You guys are the best. All right. I have no complaints. I have no criti constructive criticism on bowling. I think it's literally copy pasted from Wii Sports. So that's a good thing, yeah? Thumbs up. Wow. If you can you can you can see something that if a if a copy paste from a 16 year old game is acceptable and okay, like that says a lot for Nintendo Switch Sports, doesn't it? It's like okay, well you did the bare basic, you did the bare minimum, and that's what we got. Oh my gosh. 
I love it. Okay, so that being said, are you guys ready for the special mode? Give me some bowling pins, some emotes in the chat. Let's give it a shot. Let's see what's going on with it. Um, overall, I'm excited for it. I think that this is great. I love the fact that I found like a little area where I can throw a straight ball every single time. That's kind of cool. Um, yeah, I don't know. I, I've shown you guys that you could do some really interesting hooks if you like twist um, on your way there. If you play bowling with a hook and you just kind of, which is really, really fun actually. So anyway, I see a lot of uh, hype in the chat. Let's do it. All right, let's do this. Do we finally have customizable balls? Uh, Infernal, I think that you, if you play online a lot, you can unlock different skins for stuff. And then you just go from there. Well, trust me, we'll mess around with online a little bit later. Uh, not today, because we're literally, what, four hours into the launch of the game, so we won't, we won't play online yet. Not a lot of people have the game. Um, so tomorrow, tomorrow the next day, we'll play some online stuff and see what we can unlock. Ideally, I would be a happy camper if you get a golden anything. If you get a golden bowling tee, a golden bowling ball, maybe a golden bowling glove, like something golden, I would I would absolutely love it. That, that's my that's my requirement. I'm I'm a simple man with some simple needs, man. Just give me a good game. Is that is that so hard to ask? All right, here we go. Let's jump in. We're back with Nintendo Switch Sports Bowling. We're gonna try something brand new, and uh, I'm actually excited for this because this is a brand new mode that hasn't been done in the previous Nintendo Switch titles. Albeit in Nintendo Switch uh, or Nintendo Wii Sports, way back in the day, there were some like little barricades and stuff like that. But this one's a lot different from what I've seen in previews. So overall, very excited. Uh, overcoming obstacles to knock down pins. The lanes chains. The, the lanes change every time. Uh, let's try beginner. Let's go for it. I'm excited for this. Very much so. I want to see what this is all about. All right, you ready? All right, let's go, cat dad. Okay. Well, uh, according to this, there is... Oh, what? What the heck is that? Get that out of here. I may need to put like a little spin on this in order to get past that obstacle. That's gross. And it's a timing based spin? Oh my, I'm bad. Okay, that was a little too much spin. I need to do a little bit more subtle. That's a straight ball. Ew! Okay, so what do I win here? What's the, what's the point? That was one frame? Oh, okay, what is that? A little, is that a dip? Is that a hill? What? I don't know what the heck we're doing, but I'm gonna maybe do this because it looks like it's an upwards hill. No idea, but let's bowl. Hey, a little bit of, a little bit of adjustment because I saw that little hill there. Definitely helped me out there. So beautiful. We'll take a strike. Love it. Okay, obstacles. Ooh, what is this? A ramp? Oh, cool. Okay, we've never had ramps before. This is exciting. It's a new take on bowling. I love it. You've done something right, game. <gasps> Go up a ramp and give me a strike. Nope. Okay, that's fair. Up a ramp. Let me see if I can hit this. At least get two of them. Launch one to the other side. Oh, close. All right, that's fair. Didn't pick up all the pins, but that was quite interesting. All right, let me see this one. Okay, so we have the little uh, divider looking thing and we have some uphill. Weird. I think I could do this to like bypass this entirely. I just want to see if this thing will do it. Like if I'm at an angle, I don't have to worry about it. Just go. Cool, man. That's good. That's good. See, I'm like playing to my Nintendo Wii Sports straight with a slight uh, slight left, but that's not the case here. I can bowl a straight ball. Not bad, especially for a beginner like me. All right, let's go. What is it? Ooh, hi. Hello. I remember you from Nintendo um, Wii Sports. All right, so we're going to bowl a straight ball straight into this. 
And we won't have to worry about it. Strikeage. Close. Okay, so now this is going to be a hard one to pick up. Maybe. Maybe not, actually. This would be relatively easy. As long as it doesn't go straight in the gutter. Yeah, we're done. Straight balls, man. And there was a little bit of up, uh, uphill, so not too bad. This is cool. Okay. Wow. Uh, I don't want to play whack-a-mole with those things, like, at all. Like, no thanks. I'm quite alright. I'm just gonna go diagonal across it. Not even worry about those guys. Oh, boom! Little split. I think I could pick it up. Honestly, I can pick that up. That's not too bad. Yeah, yeah, I got this. Watch. Watch this pick up. Watch this split pick up. Oh, boom! Oh, come on! Uh, that's what I was trying to hit it right on the side so it would shoot at the other one, but didn't happen. But that's alright. We're having fun. Oh, here we go. Ooh, look at this bridge. Okay. All right, all right. This is kind of weird and kind of liking it. All right, here we go. Bridge. Ooh. Hey, we like that. Okay. I like this. This is a nice little flavor. Uh, it's kind of like a gimmick. Some of you guys are going to play it once or twice, and then you're going to just go back to regular bowling because you're tired of the gimmick. I understand. But for a first timer, it's kinda cool. Just a little bit. Yeah, I don't really know. Um, I don't really know too much about like how ups and downs really affect. It's not like golf where I can kinda get the lay of the land and adjust, but oh well. Let's bowl downhill! Whoa! Okay! Alright, I can pick that up. Picking up is so easy in this game. Especially if you know how to bowl a straight one. Alright, 9 to... Oh, look at this. Alright, he's just in the middle. This isn't too scary. Like, you should have seen the training mode in Wii Sports. Like, there was a lot of... A lot of those barriers. Seriously, it was quite interesting. Come on, guy. Just fall down, man. up spares what do we got i like i like okay next up here's the final round uh zero zero obstacles in the challenge mode why are there zero obstacles why that was actually a really cool strike by the way see if we can get the uh ooh, see if we can get the the last frame turkey and do the turkey dance it's time for the turkey dance. It's time for the turkey dance. Oh, it is definitely not time for the turkey dance. All right, here we go. Straight ball should be good for this. Hit him in, hit him in. Oh yeah, you love that pickup. That split pickup was good. Boom, boom, diagonal. Love it, man. Love to see it. Love to see that. That is a... Chef's kiss. But you should have got a strike in the first place. Just throwing that out there. 160? Yes! Alright, not bad. That was that was fun. Beginner. That was really fun. Uh what it, what do you guys think? Was that was that cool? I liked beginner. It was nice. It was like there's only a couple different things here and there. Uh that was really, really cool. Okay, twist the Joy-Con slightly when you swing to bowl a hook. The ball curve in that direction before it reaches the pins. Yes, this is true. And I can verify. The hook does work in this game. You know what? This is this is the most intuitive, flawless game. But then again, that's not saying much. Copy-paste of the exact same programming from the game 16 years ago. Uh, anyway, um, yeah, what do you guys think? Should we jump into Intermediate? I think that'd be fun. Yeah, that was great. Bowling, that was so much fun, actually. Let's do intermediate. All right, let's go. Here we go. Here we go. I'm excited to see what intermediate is all about. Here we go. 
Ooh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Big timing over here. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. But, but I can bypass one of them by just going on the side. Watch this. Oh, yeah. Ooh, that's kind of a weak split. Okay, well, I mean, that's right in the middle. That's fine. We can get it. We can get it. Just throw it like that. Done. Pick up the spare. Let me get over 150 and we'll call it a good game. Alright, next up. Preparing the next lane. Whoa, you've got some like weird dips over here. So, that's gonna be really tough. I, I don't know where to aim. Honestly, I'm gonna try this. Ooh! Ooh! Oh gosh! Nasty. Yeah, that, those little hills in there just completely wrecked me. Uh, I guess I'm going to try this out. Straight ball, all the way down. Ooh, beautiful. Spare king. That's not bad. All right, not too bad, not too bad. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. Uh, what do we got, what do we got? Ooh, ooh. All right, so this is a little bit of a jump. Little jump ski right over here. I'm going to go like this. And throw. Whoa, boom. Dude, come on, jump ski. Come on. Jump ski. Let's go. Pick up the spare. Okay, easy. Bowling is not. It's not hard. We bowling. Ooh, look at this. I don't think I like this. Yeah, I, I don't. I, I, for the record, I do not like this. So I might try a little, a little spinny. Oh, oh, gross. That's a gross split right there. Okay. Um, I would be really hard-pressed if I could pick the split up. Like, no joke. Full send over here. I'm not ready. Stop walking. I'm not ready. I'm not ready. No, I'm ready. Oh, you, mm, okay, cool. Cool. I, I barely shaved that one to get launched to the side. That's fine. We'll take it. What is this? Oh, you call this advanced, huh? Okay, that's fine. It's moving. I don't know how it's moving, like, physically in real life. I don't see a track or anything underneath there. Come on, 10-pin. Dude, 10-pin is the bane. 10-pin is the bane right now. So, it's kind of a, a timing thing, right? Like, right now, it's a timing. It's not a... Anything too crazy. We could do it. Ooh, ooh, look at this. Ooh, look at you, huh? With the little hill, too? Alright, I'm going. Oh! Oh, weak. Yeah, that was pretty weak. Alright, I'll aim a little bit more towards the, uh... Towards this side. Okay, I don't think I can. Yeah, this one's going to be real hard for me to get. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. I, I guess I'm going to hit one of those pins. Great. Cool. Good job. That was a hard, hard one to pick up. Okay, so what do we have here? Moving? Oh, gosh. Double moving. I'm not going in there. I'm not going in. You can't take me. It's either the 10-pin or the 7-pin, man. They always get me. Oh! Shave it. Nice. Like a razor right on the side. Really good. Okay, next. Ooh, this one's interesting. Very interesting. Let's try it out. There's a little dip and an uphill. Boom! That's a strike. Thank you so much. I needed one. I haven't gotten a strike in a while. Taking that one. Gladly. Okay, not too many more. Here it goes. Uh-huh, uh-huh. This is the exact... I've seen this in Wii Sports. Yeah, this one is in Wii Sports for sure. Pull it right down the middle. Okay, very bad. I gotta somehow hook that. I don't know how I'm going to. I'm very bad. But uh, I can try an extreme hook. You guys want to see an extreme hook? Hook? That's... No... <laughs> Oh, okay, fine. 
I gotta work on my extreme hook a little bit here. Uh, this one's gonna be no frills. This one's gonna be no frills bowling. We're gonna do this, because I've done this strike many times before. Weird split. Okay. Weird split. Uh, I can do this. I can pick this up. Watch me pick this up. I will be a champ if I pick it up. Oh, come on. <laughs> I was so close. If I was a little bit over, that would have been great. Okay, you know what? I think over 100? 140? Hey, that's not too bad for uh, that mode. It's my hand. It's cool. I like it. Let's do the expert mode. Let's change it. So overall, adjust your position. Use the stick to move yourself. Like, okay, that's already on screen. Like, teach me something else. But I don't think there's anything else. All right, here we go. Advanced. Last one. And then we'll go online. We'll do some online play. All right, how expert is this going to be? Whoa. Um... What? I'm sorry. That's at an angle. That's an unnatural angle. What? You're telling me I got to go with a left, a right spin down here? No way. That's very expert. I don't know if I know how to do that, but I'm gonna try. That was kind of cool. I did like a, a little McTwist. I don't want to do it again. This is hard. It's, I don't, I, I, I'm gonna like crank it, dude. No way. All right, that was pretty expert. This? I don't think I could throw it over that, so this is just a timing game at this point. Once that goes down, those do go up. Or I could just do this. Okay, not bad. Not bad. So as the back ones are going down, that's when you throw it, because you'll be all set and ready to go. As the back ones are going down. Or I can kind of squeeze through. Yeah, I could squeeze through this. Or just get some good timing. Yeah, yeah, perfect. Not bad. Uh, I don't know. What do you think about this mode? Like, I think the gimmick is starting to wear off on me. It was kind of cool at the beginning, but now it's just like... Gross. I don't know if I want to do this, you know? Okay, um, yeah, this one's gonna be really hard. Kind of. All right, I can get that other one. I can pick it up, I can pick it up. Let's pick this up. Step on the gas. Oh! Okay, cool. Uh, all but one pin. I mean, that's pretty much a strike. You've already figured out the puzzle at that point. This is interesting. Okay. It's a lot of timing that you're waiting on over here. And you also have to wait on um, whether or not you want the... Oh, thank you. That was great. You're, whether or not you want the, the little bridge to move left or right. Oh, that was really good. Look at me. I'm the only one doing these crazy like setups while everyone else is playing boring bowling. Get out of here. All right, this is weird. I don't like the physics of this, but whatever. Bring it on. Oh, that is really to the left. Okay, great. Uh, let's move this a little bit here and try, try again. Whoa. Oh, boo. All right. You need a lot more different angle uh, for that one. But anyway, that was kind of fun. All right, I'm going to do this. This is a straight ball strike. Watch. Straight ball strike. Boom. In before, baby. You love it. <laughs> this is a straight ball strike, and then he gets it. Okay, what's next? Let's see. Don't touch it. Oh, the first time I hit an obstacle. The first gutter 
A ball. No way, man. No actual way, man. Get out of here. Let me get a strike to make up for it. Thanks. First gutter ball. Unbelievable. All right, all right. What's next? Ooh, this is gonna be fun. Watch, 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 watch. You gotta do like a little, I don't, you gotta do like a little baby McTwist. A little baby McTwist here. Watch this, watch this. Oh, that was terrible. Yikes. Second gutter McBall. Oh, great. Decent McTwist, but not enough. I gotta really, really pay attention to that. Next. This one's gonna be fun. Ooh, come on, knock it over, guy. That was, that's really hard. You need some real, real twist on it. <gasps> no way, no way. If you don't get it the first time, you're not picking that up. All right, here we go, the last frame. Oh, it's just gonna be regular old bowling. Yay, your favorite. Watch. Strike! Ooh! No, we don't like that. But we do like picking up the, uh, the ten pen. With a straight. Easy. And then I'll get the, uh, the final frame. I'll do a strike, and then we'll call it a day. Watch this. Watch this for style points. Watch this for style points. I'm gonna do it behind my back. You know you love that. You know you love that. <laughs> wow. Yes. Slow clap. Behind the back, man. What a guy. Yeah. Yeah, I know. I know. It's it's bowling, man. It's really good. It's really good at it. Just kidding. All right, anyway. That was the challenge mode of bowling. Uh, we're gonna go back to sports selection. Let's play online. Let's see what's up. Don't miss out on items. Rumor has that uh, that after three weeks are up, it may not be available again for a good long while. Don't. Don't make this artificial manufactured scarcity. I'm not falling for it. To force you to play the game within three weeks, you're gonna miss out. No. Anyway, so bowling. Special challenges. Really fun. I thought they were great. Uh, it's a cool gimmick. But um, I think that after you play it once or twice, what's the motivation to do it again, right? I think there's, for a single player mode, I think there's zero motivation for me to do that ever again. I, I, I will not. Just throwing it out there. Does the game keep a high score for it? Sure. Do you get rewarded for a high score? Are there benchmarks for high scores that can help you unlock different items within the game? There aren't. So what's the motivation for me to go over there and play it? Anyway, just some thoughts that I'm throwing out to the universe. Um, I'm excited for online bowling, so let's jump into that right now. Anyway, thanks for watching. Yeah. Anyway, so am I wrong about that? Am I wrong? What What do you guys think about that? Let's Let's talk. Let's take a little breather and and talk about bowling. What's your What's your first impressions? There's no motivation for anyone to go back and do that locally, unless you're like, Hey, mom and dad, want to see something cool? You think you're good at bowling? Wait till you get a load of this. And then your mom and dad are gonna be like, uh, okay, cool, thanks kid. Let's just go back to regular bowling. All right. So that's gonna be the conversation that's gonna happen in every household. Substitute mom and dad with brother, sister, girlfriend, boyfriend, grandma, grandpa. That's gonna be exactly that. You're not gonna play these modes. I don't know, that's just what I think. <laughs> Uh, I did like that the there, the idea of a challenge mode was there. The bowling team on Nintendo Switch Sports understood the assignment, albeit not as best as it could be, but they understood like, hey, we're gonna do something other than just bowling, other than just volleyball, other than just tennis. They did something extra. So hats off to them, good job. But that's not saying much. Anyway, let's do some bowling online. Um, I know how to do some strikes. As you guys see over here, I did a little turn around and that's pretty epic. Someone clipped that if you didn't already. Um, let's go. Let's do it. Here we go, bowling. Welcome back everyone. It's Abdallah here with more Nintendo Switch Sports Bowling. We're gonna go online and we're gonna hopefully play against someone. 
that knows how to bowl. Uh, we're going to find out what kind of modes you can do in bowling online. If it's going to be the, um, the challenge mode, special mode, or if it's just regular old bowling. And uh, we'll see what's up. But anyway, bowling's been pretty fun. It's pretty true to the original. Uh, and in case... Oh, whoa. Okay. Wow. Hello? Boom. 16 people bowling at the same time? That's cool. Let's go. Did not expect that. I was thinking like one or four. All right. Well, let's see exactly how this works. Um, so as you can see over here, there's no special bowling online. It's just, all right, everyone, you're just gonna... Survival bowling. Survival bowling? I'm sorry, I don't know what that means. Is this good? Survival bowling. So this is like Battle Royale? Top eight out of 16 will advance. Oh, that's exciting! Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm down. I'm in for this. Yeah, yeah, I like this. All right, let's see what we got. Oh! Straight ball strikes, baby. Oh, come on. Don't do this to me. I need to get some strikage, man. I like this so far. I want to see what other people are doing. Waiting for others to finish. All right, Daisuke over here. The impossible... Okay, so some people are also getting tens on the strikes and spares. Dude got a gutter ball. Okay, I mean, in regular bowling you get gutter balls. Mm, all right, just gotta get a gotta get a strike, man. Just give me a strikeage. Oh, thank you, baby. Let's go. Let's get first place. Let's beat these folks. Let's beat them. Let's beat them. Okay, so I like this a lot. This is redeeming, 100% redeeming. You're playing online, there's a little bit of competitive nature. It's not just 16 people in a bowling alley, no, it's a legit, like, you're gonna be out, you're gonna be eliminated if you're not good. So get good or go home. I love it, thank you. I'm, a smile, a smile on my face from this game? Oh my gosh, please, tell me more. Yes, This is this the redeeming reason why you're going to get Nintendo Switch Sports and play along with? Yo, let me bowl these noobs. Let me out bowl these guys. Oh, that's actually terrible. Boom, boom. Okay. So, two spares and a strike is actually really good. We'll see if anyone could do any better. I like this. Eliminated. Dude, Daisuke. Who else is here? Mia? All lanes done. Round one results. F wow. Okay, the competition is real right now. Okay. Wow. Okay, top five out of nine will advance the next three frames. Okay, make it happen, Cap'n. Did you see him, like, shake out his sweaty hand? That was cool! Nice, nice little idle animation. Thank you, baby! That's how we do it in this household. Don't talk to me. Mia. Kentaro. Tatsuaki. Wait, wait, Tatsuaki? That was a me character in the old game. Am I playing against bots? Chika? Kentaro? These are the names of bots! Oh no! Could it be that people in real life have these names or are they simulated bots? Just to make you feel like you're playing online like Mario Kart Tour. Yikes. I don't know. I cannot tell you. It would make sense. You're like, alright, you got so many people playing over here. Look at these real life people. I don't know. But it's very suspicious that like a lot of these names are the exact names from the Miis from the previous game. Ooh, give me, ooh, I will pick that up. I will pick that up. Although I should not be hitting any of these like that. Yeah, I got this. 
Oh my gosh, yes! I should get extra points for picking up a split. That was so good. Ding ding! Ooh, Joy-Con drop, baby. That was really good. All lanes done. No, I'm not done. I'm gonna do my thing first, dude. Chill. I'm out here enjoying myself picking up these spares. Ooh! That's a split. Ooh, no, it's not! That's two strikes in three frames. Oh, man, don't touch me. I'm in triple digits, baby. Woo! All right, don't even talk to me. Don't. You guys got nothing. Executive Mia. So you can do, like, your little taunts on the side over here. It's pretty cool. I don't know... I don't, I, I can't confirm. I have a sneaking suspicion that no one's this bad. Like, just out of the box. And, okay, so, and Shinosuke? Dude, Shinosuke is the exact name of some me characters in Wii Sports. I mean, yeah, I don't know how popular of a name Shinosuke is, but I've got a suspicion that these are not real people online. And there's no way that I'm in triple digits out here, destroying these guys, and they're in, like, low 20s and 30s. That just doesn't make sense to me. Out the box. And usually the thing is, right, like, I mean, you're playing against people right now at the, in, in our time zone. Like, maybe some Japanese players are out here. Like, and usually Japanese players dominate the playing field. But there's no way that I'm this far ahead. I'm not that good. I'm good. But like I'm not I'm not the best. I was expecting a lot better competition, but I'll take a strike anyway, man. I love this. I don't know. Maybe cuz it's the first match. I don't know about that. I didn't see this mode in multiplayer on local, but I didn't actually go into local, so... I'm hoping that in local multiplayer, if you have like three friends over, along with yourself, you can do elimination bowling. That would be amazing. Yeah, that'd be so cool. Like, bowling is the redeeming game over here, man. And as it would be, because bowling was the best game. Look at that double. Because bowling was the best game on the Nintendo Wii version, right? Wii bowling made history. It was so iconic. But the fact that I'm out here doing 170, which is like double, triple their scores, like, I don't know. I saw some of them emoting too. Okay, let's make it to the finals. 170. I could just drop my ball every time and still win. I guess I'm gonna go for... I guess I'm gonna go for the 200, I guess. Alright, here we go. Bowling. Final round. Look at them emoting like they're real people. Dude, bowling dev team did a pretty good job. Just saying, man. This is the golden standard for the dev team on this. Boom! Baby, get off of me! I love that. Yes. Bowling's good. <sighs> Yo, it's time for the turkey dance. 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 Watch. Can I do it? Are you ready? Are you ready to taunt these completely real human players on the other side of the world playing with me right now with scores of 20 and 30 in the final frame? Are you ready? Oh, I'm ready. It's time for the turkey dance. It's time for the turkey dance. It's time for the turkey. Oh, come on. <laughs> I don't think I aimed that right. Oh, man. 
The final results, two something. Two tw okay, I don't I don't think people are that bad at bowling. Like at all. Finish. Okay, I got a PB, a personal best. 228. That's great. 40 play bonus. Ooh, ranking bonus 80. Ooh! Yo! Wow! Cool! Oh my gosh! Yo, this is the way to grind out points in the game. Dude, forget playing anything else. Oh my gosh, I like this a lot. I do want the new volleyball. I want the new badminton rackets. I need all of this stuff. Oh, I like the simple collection. Yes, a new Chambara. Tricolor sword. Oh, you know what? Aim your throw. Really? Dude, it's in the UI that shows that. That's not a tip. Okay. Low-key, I like this. Low-key, there was a little... Whoa, now you can choose up to three sports? What does that mean? You can now choose up to three sports. Choosing multiple sports means you'll find a match much, much faster. Try this if you can't decide to play which sport. Okay, so there's a random sport. All right, that's great. So I was saying like low key, there was an ounce of me that's like, dude, I wanna play bowling. I wanna play competitive bowling all the time and I wanna grind out and I wanna get every single piece in the simple set. That was a thought that went through my mind in this game, Nintendo Switch Sports. And that's the first time I ever had a want to play this game. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Okay, so Loki, that is amazing. It is a good, it's a good concept, right? So you take this dev team that said, well, what are we going to do with Wii Sports Bowling 16 years later? What are we going to do to revolutionize it and make it better? And online, other than just playing a game. Dude, they make an elimination. That's so big brain. Compliments. It took me about three hours of playing this game to finally give out a compliment. Man, that's good. So happy for that. I will 100% play that again. Very much so. Is it worth the hard carry of all six games? I don't know yet. But right now, bowling is number one. And I knew it would be. Because I think that the dev team had a boss that was like, dude, don't mess this up. Or else you guys are all out. And they're like, all right, boss. We won't mess it up. But still, the lack of medals. And like overall grind. I don't know. We got a lot of cool points, but like once you grind out all the points, what else is there, right? Like what else is there to do? Once you did all the simple set and then the fun, funky color set, then what are you doing with the points? Are you holding them for the next time? You're waiting 13 days for the next grind? I don't know. Anyway, conversations for another time. That was amazing. That's bowling. Next up, ooh, I don't even know what we have for next, but I am excited. Uh, we're gonna do all sorts of different games. We're gonna do every single one of them. You guys know this, right? Uh, next up, according to my list, is going to be, uh, we did volleyball, we did tennis. Ooh, badminton! Okay, I'm hoping that badminton's gonna be good, because, uh, honestly, just very, very excited for it. I love badminton. So, anyway, join me for that one. It'll be a really good one. Anyway, thanks so much for watching, and, uh, let me know what you guys think. It's great. We'll see you on the next one. Alright, guys. What do we think? Let's talk. Let's talk. Unfiltered hot takes. What do we bring it all on me? Bring it all on me. Do you think that we bowling? It's like we bowl. We sports bowling plus right now. Um, that's what it kind of feels like. Sure, the challenge mode throw away. You're not gonna do it. You're gonna play it once and you're never gonna touch it. I'm never gonna touch it again. There's no motivation to. There's no scoring system. There's no ranking. There's no rewards for doing it. So therefore, it's a dead mode after I played it once. And so that in of itself is a, it's a miss on the developer's front, right? You want people to play your game. You want people to enjoy a mode more than once because obviously you put the dev time into developing beginner and intermediate and expert stages, but you couldn't figure out a reward system for people to play it. Like, how do you mess that up, right? All right, that feedback aside, I think that the online mode is pretty solid. I probably played a bunch of bots. Low key, I'm like 90% sure I played against bots, but it felt really good. Um, did it feel good? I don't think it did. No, I didn't really. I don't think I deserved that win. If I got like a 220 
and best person over there got 40? Like, no. I don't know, man. I don't know about it. Yo, what's up? Empire Arcadia, what's going on? Good to see you. How have you been? Uh, we're out here trying to figure out what we like and what we dislike about this game, but thanks for coming. Glad to see you. Um, uh, Mattia over here in the comments says, Switch Sports in general needs a lot more extra modes per sport to be worth it. 100%. And I can't resonate that enough. I seriously can't resonate that enough. Um, and that's my main criticism about this game, is that it's rushed, and there's not enough content for $50. Um, yeah. So anyway, what else are you guys thinking? Uh, I don't like online mode. Uh, okay, hold on. Uh, the A game says, I don't like that online mode is mostly all bots instead of actual people, and you're not a Nintendo Switch online person. I don't understand that. Well, I think it only got populated with bots because no one was online. You can't make that snap judgment that says if you click on online, it's gonna be all bots. I don't think so. I think there's some sort of, um, I think there's some sort of programming code in the game that's like, all right, if there's no one online, fill all 16 slots with bots, like whatever. I don't really care because I'm getting my rewards at the end of the day. So yeah, I'm good. I'm good. And I'm going to qualify a lot easier. So I'm going to get way more rewards. So I'm okay with that. If you want to play with friends, then play with friends. But if you're not a Nintendo Switch online subscriber, then you have no right to complain about the online. <laughs> so that's just that. It's like someone who, um, it's like so someone who piggybacks off a Netflix account and then complains that they're gonna get rid of, they're gonna start charging people to piggyback off a of Netflix account. It's like, you're not a subscriber, so you don't have a voice. <laughs> anyway, um, what else are we thinking? Uh, what are we thinking about bowling? Talk to me about bowling, bowling, bowling. Um, yeah, I don't know. I heard a lot of feedback in the comments saying that you guys are canceling pre-orders, this, that, or the other. I don't know, I, I can't tell you yet because we've really only touched base on three of the six games. Badminton, I love badminton in real life. Like I told you earlier, like all racket sports, I 100% love. Um, do I have high aspirations for it? I don't. I'm gonna keep my expectations super low based off of how bad volleyball was and how bad tennis was. Tennis was a train wreck. Volleyball was at least kind of new and exciting. Um, but yeah, just really excited to see what that's gonna be about. Um, yeah, there's no real like pickup um, yeah, there's no pickup, like spare pickup modes, which was really fun. I like that in Wii Sports, right? I don't know. I think they, they did an okay job. Like if I were to rate bowling right now, I'd probably give it a seven out of 10. Yeah. Volleyball, I'll get a four out of four out of 10. Tennis, two out of 10. Bowling, seven, because there's good content there. And for a split second, I wanted to play more. And if a game wants you to play more, that's great. But then on the uh, on the other foot, it's just like, oh dude, I don't ever want to play the obstacle bowling ever again. Like I will vow to never touch that mode because it's dumb. It's gimmick, right? It's gimmick. You do it once and you're like, all right, cool. That was fun. There's no reward challenge for doing it. If there was an achievement system, if there was a fully fleshed out achievement system that says, you know, score 200 or higher on beginner, uh, special mode in bowling. Like, oh great, and then you unlock this. Uh, score 150 or higher in intermediate. You unlock this. Like, it's so basic, right? Fortnite does it with their battle passes. Uh, Pokemon Unite has a battle pass. You know, beat X amount of games. There's like daily achievements that you can do in games. But this game is just like, you know, it's half-baked. It's a half-baked $50 game. Get more content out of Pokemon Unite and that's free to play. I don't know, man. Um, just some unfiltered opinions right now. All right, so uh, yeah, really exciting. Really exciting. Yeah, honestly, Jenny has it right. Jenny's like speaking my language here. Jenny says, it's only a seven out of 10 by comparison to the other bad games that are on here. Uh, just based off the ones that we played. So I don't really wanna jump to too many conclusions, but just know that bowling was actually fun. Online elimination bowling was great. But is it going to be the savior? Is that going to be worth your $50 of playing this game? Tennis is a throwaway. Volleyball is, I don't know. I don't know yet on volleyball. I'm just really bummed you can't do like bump, bump spike instead of bump set spike every time. 
Maybe there's a way, I just don't know it. Anyway, I'm excited. I think it's gonna be fun. Okay, that's gonna be it for me right now. Let's jump into our next live stream. Uh, our next live stream is gonna be jumping on to, what did we say, Bad Minton? Uh, I will be referring to the, uh, the little thing that you hit in midair. I will be referring to that as a birdie. Just letting you know. I will not be referring to it any other name. It's the birdie. Don't you dare um actually me. <laughs> that is a birdie. We're calling it a birdie just for the sake of this video and all future videos involved with that. Okay, it's currently one o'clock right now. Uh, let's do let's do one thirty uh, for this next one. I'll make this public so that you guys can all see it. Uh, I'm excited, honestly. First look at badminton. Uh, I've heard that badminton is actually really good. I don't know too much about how it's going to be. The from what limited reviews I've heard for the game, seems kind of cool. Just overall excited for it. Uh, but badminton, man. I play badminton in real life. I have a net. I have a bunch of birdies that I use. I destroyed a bunch of my birdies. Like, I smash hard. Yo, when I smash... <laughs> That's a quote right there. That's a quote for the books. When Abdallah smashes, he smashes hard. <laughs> Great. All right, uh, that's gonna be it for me right now. You guys have the link. Um, I'll see you guys in about 30 minutes where we're gonna go through and do badminton. But uh, ultimately, I wanna hear from you guys in the comments. What do you think about bowling? Seriously, tell me what you honestly think about it, right? Because we have a game. We have a game right over here. Wii Sports Bowling was phenomenal. You had four game modes, right? You had the training modes, the three different training modes, and then you had regular bowling, which was iconic and classic. 16 years later, we have this new one on Nintendo Switch, which I want to say 99% is a copy paste of the coding. There's really nothing new about it. It's bowling. What else are you going to make new about it, right? Like devil's advocate over here. What else are you going to make new about bowling? But what I really enjoyed about them is the fact that online is smooth and online is in elimination mode. That's really fun. I wish you had more options for online. I wish you can just go online and choose to play, you know, 10 frames, right? That's not an option. Why was it just elimination? You know, if you want to play 10 frames with whoever is on board and not get eliminated first frame, like, that should be an option for people to play. But it's not a thing. So there's just, you really have to, I don't know, man. I just think that they didn't really storyboard this game out. Really, it seems like it seems like a last minute cash grab off of a dev team that was rushed to copy paste all the coding and maybe make some new coding for some new games like badminton and chambara and soccer. Um, that's kind of what it really feels like on the surface level. Is it a bad game by any means? No, it's not. Could it have been better? Light years, light years better um, with a couple more, I don't know, months of development time. But then again, global pandemic, Maybe that's their excuse. Maybe they had a boss riding on them saying, yo, dude, get the game out. I don't care. We'll patch it later. I don't care if you're not done with golf. We're sending it out. Well, that's on you that we didn't get golf in there because you didn't program it fast enough. So we'll just make it DLC later. I don't know. I don't know. But anyway, tell me your honest thoughts about everything bowling and we'll go from there. I'll see you guys in a little bit for uh, badminton. Thanks for watching and thanks for cheering me on. And did you guys see me do the, uh, the strike behind the back? I don't know what I was thinking there, but that was really fun. All right, guys. Have a great rest of your day. We'll see you in about half an hour for badminton. Take care.